Welcome to Synchronize. Let's take a look at how to send an individual link. Files inside of Synchronize can be shared by sending a link to that file to another person. To send a link, hover over any file and click the Action Menu button. Then select Send Link. The Send Link screen will appear. Sending a link is beneficial if the file you are sending is too large to email, such as a long PDF or multimedia file. Another benefit of sending a link is the addition of control over how long the link will be active. This functionality is known as an expiring link. Expiration dates for links are mandatory. Click the calendar drop-down and select an expiration date for your link. Then. You can determine how long to allow an individual access to the link after they first access the file. You can then establish the number of times a recipient of a link can click the link. The default is unlimited, but this can be changed to any number of clicks available in the given dropdown. The Send Link operation also provides you with a notification option for when the link has been viewed. Click the checkbox next to Notify me when viewed to receive this notification. You have the option to restrict a single mobile device or IP address as needed. For production security purposes, if a user forwards a link, this feature will prevent the link from being viewed by an unintended recipient. Please be aware when using this feature, your recipient should access the link from the device in which they intend to read the material. Once finished, Click the Next button. Select your recipients from either the available distribution lists or list of individuals. Note that a recipient will need to create a password to open the link if they've never logged in to Synchronize before. Click the Next button. Then, review your recipients, deselecting individuals if necessary. Fill out the message to be included with the link by typing a subject line message, and signature. Once finished, click the Send Email button. The recipient will receive an email with a link and will also be shown the security parameters surrounding the link. And that's how to send an individual link in Synchronize. Thanks for watching.